a smart way to raise backyard chickens. This guy, Rich Jamiro, explains in today's text mark. Good morning, Rich. Such a fun story. Yeah, I was really looking like... forward to this one. Yeah, I mean, it's chickens. Yeah, Come on, the, I love the puns it. are aplenty. <laughs> uh, less waste, a better understanding of nature, and of course, fresh eggs. These are all the things that come with raising backyard chickens. Well, now one startup is using technology to help anyone become an instant farmer. We got lettuce, we got tomatoes for the girls. Los Angeles artist and author Brady Smith has been raising backyard chickens for 10 years. Every single day that I get one of these eggs, it still blows me away. He has nine hens and says they've taught his kids about nature and responsibility. They live in the coop. They go in at night on their own. I shut the door behind them, and then at, in the morning, they all wait patiently, and I open the, and they just come out. The fresh eggs make a delicious breakfast. They're very simple to care for, but you have to care for them. <laughs> oh, come on, come on, yeah, yeah, come here. Tech entrepreneur AJ Forsyth wants to bring that experience of being a backyard farmer to more people. We have a belief that there's uh, millions of Americans that have always wanted to raise chickens, but they don't know where to start. His startup is called Called Coop. If you bring technology and make it effortless, then anyone can do it. They're making a smart coop that holds four to six chickens with modern conveniences like an automatic door and cameras for remote AI monitoring from your phone. And it turns out AI can be useful for eggs too. These cameras can detect everything from predators to an open door. The average uh, American house throws out about 250 to 300 pounds of like perfectly edible food a year. You can just basically turn it into eggs the next day. Even the compostable litter tray is smart. Just pull it out and swap for a new one. The goal of the company is anyone with a backyard that wants to should be able to raise chickens. It's a commitment like any pet, but I highly recommend them, they're fun. Now the smart coop costs about $2,000 after current discounts plus a monthly monitoring fee. Chickens are sold separately. All right, if you want more information on the smart coop, you can go to my website. It is richontech.tv. Now I will tell you, Brady, uh, the guy who has the eggs in his back or the chickens in his backyard, did give me some farm fresh eggs. Mm -hmm. I was hesitant to try them. Why? I don't know well, why. Yeah. I had never tried like the a freshest. farm fresh egg. Yeah. It was amazing. Yeah. You could taste the difference. Abs 100%. Wow. Like. And my kid who made it for me, uh -huh. Tanner, after he cracked it and did it all, he goes, 10 minutes later, he comes up and goes, can I do one of those for me? Ooh. Um, what are the legalities of having a chicken coop in your backyard? According to Coop, in most places, you are allowed to have these, even with, HO with HOAs who try to discourage so it. Yeah. yeah. So they have actually a printable letter if you run into oh. any issues on their website that you can send in. Yeah, suck an egg. <laughs> <laughs> suck an egg. Here's the letter. <laughs> That's all it says. Yeah, exactly. That's Suck it. An egg. Yep. Look it up. <laughs> uh, great story, as always. It's fun, too, because there are more and more people that are actually doing this and kind of talking about it. At least I, I've run into some yeah. uh, people. Would it be nice to have a, a fresh egg a day? It would. You know, I mean, that's what you get, as we know. I'm just saying, you know, I'm going to move on, Megan. I've got so many things to my Please. head right now. I'm, talk know. I'm thinking all Pineapple over Express. You're talking eggs. Sounds like a, there's a lot going on. There's a lot. <laughs> so much. There's a lot going on.